everyone. So this is going to be a video on my diet and exercise routine. Um, now that I think you guys know that I have recovered from my eating disorder, um, I'm finally getting back to a healthy uh, diet. So um, I just wanted to let you guys know because I got a lot of requests for this video. Um, so I usually for my diet it's a little strange but somehow I manage it and I stay skinny and I stay healthy and let me tell you something I eat like a horse but I never gain any weight so it's it's cool um, and I do go to the gym daily um, just to help you out you know just to help yourself out you gotta eat right and exercise so you can you know get the muscles going and burn the fat down the unnecessary fat so um, usually for breakfast I usually have cereal it's pretty normal with uh, non-fat milk. Um, I'm not really a big fan of 1% or anything like that. Um, I'm just more of a fat-free person, you know, you gotta cut down the fats on that. Um, so that's pretty normal. Um, I don't really eat those sugary cereals, that's really bad for you because that, it, just to let you guys know, that can zap your energy in an instant. Um, usually like uh, Rice Krispies is good for you or something like that. Or just some like oats or something, but not like the... Uh, Reese's Puffs or um, Frosted Flakes, those are really bad for you. They're just going to zap your energy and you're just going to get tired. Um, then sometimes I'll have a yogurt on top of that. Um, I have fat-free uh, yo plate. Um, that's pretty good. Um, so I kind of kind of keep my fats down maybe till around lunchtime, dinner time. Um, so for lunch, I usually have um, what do I usually have? It all varies. Sometimes I'll have a salad with, um, a light sandwich or something, which is really good for you. Um, you should have your greens every day. Eat your green vegetables, kids. You really should have greens. Um, but I don't eat salad every day. Usually it's just a light sandwich or something. Then I'll kind of move on to the junk, junk food because I crave, I have a sweet tooth for ice cream. And I've actually read in 17 that I that actually ice cream is good for you. I don't know if that's true, but they said that you do need some fat whatsoever and that it'll actually fill you up. Um, but I personally don't eat ice cream. I eat frozen yogurt for me that tastes the same as ice cream, but it's just healthier for you. So frozen yogurt is good for you. Um, ben and Jerry's is really good. You should have Ben and Jerry's frozen yogurt. Um, uh, so they have like really low fat for um, their fats from Ben and Jerry's frozen yogurt. It's usually like three grams of fat. Um, the calories is a little high, just 200 for about a half a cup, but I can take 200. Um, what else do I have? Usually I have a lot of fruit. Um, if I want something sweet and I'm not going to have any more junk food, it's usually, uh, you know, just a nectarine or strawberries or peaches, whatever I have in, the, in my house for fruit. And then I just kind of mix it up and enjoy that, like make it a fruit salad for me. And then uh, usually um, I'll wait till dinner time and then I'll have whatever's for dinner. Uh, my parents uh, don't really, we don't, we never eaten at fast food restaurants before. I've never eaten at fast food restaurants. I've never eaten at McDonald's. I've never eaten at Wendy's, uh, Taco Bell, any of the things like that. Everything that I eat is homemade. Um, I never, just saying, I never eaten at a restaurant. So that's why my family's kind of very lean, you know? So. Yeah, we, we love our fish, we love our meats, we have everything, so it's really good for you. Um, and my exercise, I only go at nighttime because I think I'm more motivated at nighttime. I don't know why. Um, I think it's better to exercise in the morning, but for me, it doesn't work for me personally. Um, just because, I don't know, I get very, I'm not a morning person at all. I can be very nasty in the morning, so uh, nighttime is, is the right time for me. I usually do um, uh, the treadmill. Um, I do run, I do walk, uh, about an hour, then I do, um, some aerobics and I take yoga classes every Sunday, then I do a little bit of weightlifting, not so much to torture myself, um, and I don't want to get to the point where I'm getting too muscular, so that's not happening. Um, what else? I do racquetball. Um, I do shoot hoops for fun. I'm not in, like, the basketball team or anything, just for fun. Um, I don't even know how to play basketball, so don't laugh. But, I will tell you that I don't play basketball. What else do I do? Um, that's pretty much it. I do a lot of exercise, and I go every single day except for 
usually Fridays and Saturdays because I just need to take a break. You know, you, you don't have to exercise every single day. It's kind of bad for you. You need to take a break at some point. Um, but that is my exercise and diet uh, routine. So um, tell me what you guys think about my changes. Um, I think it's pretty good. I didn't really used to exercise that much. Um, what else? I haven't really been gaining it. I'm kind of losing weight that lately. I don't know why that is, but I've been I've been losing weight. Um, but that's good, you know. Just it's it's healthy. So that is the update on my diet and exercise routine. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I am not trying to tell you that this is what you should do as your routine. I'm just sharing what I do personally. Um, but yeah, so tell me what you guys think. So thanks for watching this video guys. Bye bye.